computer. Instance log supplemental. Well, I can't help but notice that uh, that crazy ass bush is still following me around. And another tree grew overnight. Yay! These trees are like amazing. They should have had these kind of trees back on Earth, man. They just grow everywhere. Anyway, I've knocked a few down. And I tried to find a happy cricket. Couldn't do it. Also, the octopus miner has not come back. Um, I was hoping that when it got low on power, it would come back, but it seems how it shot off in that general direction and vanished when I reset the frickin' uh, scanner. Yeah, so I uh, found something else to do with my time. And I'll show you that here in a second. And it's here at this location. Uh, you know how I get. So I start doing some mining, excavating down over there, and I may uh, kind of close it in, you can see. <clears throat> but yeah, I was a little disappointed that the frickin' octopi didn't come back. I'm just gonna keep waiting. It might have crashed somewhere, I'm not really sure. But... I don't know. I don't know. So I'm gonna head on down here and show you what I did. So I was able to get some mining done, you can see, or excavating. I wanted this a little bit bigger. Um, then I decided I'd go ahead and uh, put a hatch in, leading to an underground uh, area. Now this is how I get my ships in and out of this area. Check it out. Down there mining, welding. Got some storage going in. Um, I got access over here. I could jetpack down, but let's see how this works. Now this door tends to uh, block my ladder, so I'm gonna go ahead and close it real quick. Let's see, did I set one of these up? No. It's gotta be that one. So yeah, when that door is open, it kind of blocks my ladder I put in over here. I might have to uh, move it over a bit, but let's go down here. Alright, there we go. So it's a pretty big hole. And I've got some control, but I haven't really finished everything, obviously. Um, it's getting there. Not really sure what I'm going to do. I kind of make it up as go along as far as designing areas. Um, starting to pipe some stuff in, but you know what the amazing part was? Let's see, where, where the hell's my ladder at? Over here? Ah! I thought I had a ladder going down. Oh, I think it's over here. Oh, I might have blocked it with this freaking control panel. Yep, I did. Darn it! I'm gonna have to move this guy. What the hell? That's okay, we'll fly down. Ah! I had to make sure that I had ladders in. Darn it, I, I can't believe I put that in right at the top of the ladder. <clears throat> and look at this. I found a vein of what you call Nequadria or whatever. So I got a little bit of supply of that running through here. That's pretty cool. And I do plan on expanding, so I'll get all that out of there. I don't know how deep that vein goes. I haven't really checked. That was interesting. Yeah, I thought this was pretty cool. So now I can, uh, uh, these ships do fit through that door. You know, you gotta be kind of careful, but long ways. Come straight down, so I had to make a shaft kind of. Now I'm not sure if that's very safe with the whole cargo container there. Even if I bring a wall down. You know what I mean? I don't want to bump that thing. So I may have to change some stuff up, like move this guy. But yeah, it's coming along pretty good. I like it. Too bad about this whole thing. I'm gonna have to grind that down. Because if I run out of freaking uh, hydrogen down there... Yeah, so I'm gonna have to grind this down. And let's see, can I... Do I have anything on me? No, but if I grind this down... I can move the parts over there. can't believe I did that. Easy. There's been some issues with that kind of stuff. Right there. There we go. Jeez. So yeah, things are taking a little longer than uh, expected with this. Oh. 
Holy crap, did I not get the computers back that thing? Um. Well, that's out of the way. I, I didn't really need that right now. Um, so yeah. That's about what I've been spending my time doing. As you can tell, something like that takes a long time. And I just try to integrate my mistakes, like busting through here. I said, oh yeah, ladder access. So I'll put a, um, something shaft going down in there <clears throat> and I like this door too it's pretty cool so I've been trying to use some uh, you know interesting new features I thought that was pretty cool um, and I haven't hooked up my sound block yet to the door um, but yeah not quite what I had in mind to begin with but I'll close all this in at some point <clears throat> but I'm really Frickin' bushes and trees is randomly showing up. It's really a drag. <clears throat> I think I'm gonna have to excavate deeper under here. Remember, I was gonna hollow this whole area out, so that'll stop the trees from growing, I'm sure. But I was kind of waiting around, thinking that the octopus would come back. Now, I know for a fact that the happy cricket's just sitting up there somewhere. Yeah, he's just sitting up there. So I'm going to have to, you know what I was thinking is taking this guy up, hovering it about 3,000 feet. Because I know it was like, you know, 2,900 feet up, I think, when I was up there getting the uh, octopus. So I could do that. Just go straight up. I haven't flown this guy in a while. So that might help me recover. And then I can jump out of here. And land the happy cricket on it, right on top there or something, and then come back down. So that might be my only option. <sighs> Easy. Ah! I'm stuck. I'm trapped in a hole. There's a hole. Oh my god! I fell right off. Ah! Oh man, I was quick with that. <laughs> what the hell just happened? <sighs> Get up there, man. I tell you, one wrong jump and you're just like careening towards the ground. Did I lose a block there or something? I thought I was uh. I need to put some kind of walkway around here. So I was thinking of just going straight up. Okay, we got years of fuel. We need to turn. Okay, we have the connectors off. The camera, we're going to turn the engines on. Not. Yeah, I wonder if I could do this with just atmospheric engines. Because you know there's a hydrogen engine problem. So let's see here. Let's unlock the gear. Now I'm wondering if I can actually uh, hover way up there with just my atmospheric engines. Oh yeah, it looks like it. So if I go straight up, I should be able to find the cricket. So I'm just watching the altitude from the base counter there. I don't want to just careen up straight up because I might hit it. Oh god, I'm already at max speed. Look at that. Okay, where am I at? <clears throat> oh, I got a ways to go. I can't really make out my my altitude. On top. Oh, there it is. Okay, we're almost at 2,000. So, wasn't it like a 2000 or was it 2000 something? I'm watching to look for its antenna popping in. Twenty-two. I mean, I must have had that antenna set low, man. Let's go up to about 3000. Uh-oh, I'm losing visibility there. Okay, so we should be close. And nothing's popping up, so and I think I was over that way more back and to the right. So I'm gonna start maneuvering a little bit. And I 
think I'm at the right height. I was going to go back and view my log file to see. Because I think I was over... This way, so... I'd be amazed if I found it. I'm pretty sure the octopus slammed into it and ground it away with the running uh, drills. Darn it, I was hoping to be able to find it. This is not the first time that I've lost a happy cricket. And I didn't learn my lesson <clears throat> by turning the frickin' antenna up. I'm pretty sure I was over this way. So I remember looking down just as I jumped out of the octopus. And I think I saw I was over here. Nothing. Darn it, I bet you it got destroyed. I don't think it ran out of fuel, because it was the anti-grav engines, and they last a long time. Alright, I don't see squat. <sighs> and where did the miner go? I thought this would work. I think it was right over this way. I'm like, maybe I'm not high enough. Let's just keep going. <laughs> I'm watching my HUD to see if the antenna pops in, but. <coughs> Darn it. Okay, so I think I'm higher than I need to be. Um. I think the antenna said uh, minivan. It won't say happy cricket, so. Yeah, I don't see it. I think it got destroyed. Darn it. I, I could make another one. But I didn't want it just floating up here where I can, you know, slam into it one day. Because I'm pretty sure this is the area I was in. I'm going to want to land before it gets too dark here. Oh, I see a white speck down there on the ground. Way over, way up by my engine. I wonder if that's it. Nah. Probably a glitch. Alright, I better start heading down. Darn it. Hard to believe I can't find that little... I mean, it is a little tiny thing, and the planet's huge, but I know the general area is right around here. Unbelievable. Yeah, I don't want to be hovering up here in the dark. should probably be <clears throat> I should probably be checking in the gully down there see if it's laying around the bottom do I not have lights on this thing what the hell It might be laying down there in the gully. I do see an odd speck down there, but I would be surprised. That thing just hovers forever. That's alright. We'll find it eventually. I won't let it... I'll build another one, really. Oh god, I'm here I am in the dark again. And this thing does not have good lights for some damn reason. So I may have to make a rough landing because I can't see Jack Squat. It's my altitude. Oh. I 
Easy does it. I'm gonna slam into something. I know it. Five hundred meters. Four hundred. Come on. I'm gonna hit the ground or something. Um. Crap. Yeah, I'm foreseeing some kind of accident. So, hang on to your seat. Let's see what am I looking at right there? Um, I just need to lock onto something. I can always park it again later. Easy. There's the tower on the right. I don't think I'm anywhere near it. No. Nope. Okay, let's just touch down for crying out loud, man. Okay, I need to go. I don't have to be straight. Evidently, I got turned around up there. Alright, let's just go. A ship over there. I think I'm clear. Over here. I think I can see the connector, so I should be in the clear. And I don't know why I don't have a ton of lights on this thing. Or do do I? No. Oh yeah, okay. There we go. That helps out a little bit. Easy does it. I'll do that again. When the sun's up. There we go. Lock it down, man. There we go. Well, made the effort. Didn't find a damn thing. A little disappointed. Anyway, I just wanted to kind of show you around what I've been working on down here. And... Yeah, I'll probably have this closed in by next time. I don't think, I mean, it won't be closed in. It might just be open hangar here. Um, these lights will be gone. They were just there for construction. Um, yeah, I might just leave this open. But walled off on the inside. Well, you guys have a good one. I'll catch you later. Um, and hopefully by then I'll find the, the cricket. And that mining vehicle will come back, man. Loaded down with ice would be really nice. <laughs> that would be just awesome. Anyway, you have a good one. Computer, in love.